I was born a combination of many great men's minds in 1776. Yes, it has been a long time. It was I who stood ready at Gettysburg to heed this country's cry. And for a thing called freedom, I had to watch while many young boys had to die. The night Mr. Lincoln was shot, I was right there at his side. I was the strength of a mighty nation and the tears that thousands cried. I have carried the burdens of the great world wars, Korea and Vietnam too. And along with the doughboys, rough riders, and the volunteer flying tigers, we did what we had to do. And when we sent up our first rocket ship, I was right there in my place. I was the beat of all America's heart and the smile on John F. Kennedy's face. I am every name on the great black wall, that hovering, towering being. And though we didn't want to go to Vietnam, we all knew that's how it had to be. I am the voice of every American ever held hostage by foreign lands. We can hold to our strength and sanity because God holds our hand. And remember these words, you that burn our flag and spit in our face. Never have we treated you with such terrible disgrace. We've accepted your people, every color, every creed, and given aid to all countries in their times of need. And we've shown by the way that we give out our hearts. Truly, we are the world, and in America is where it starts. And to Americans near and far, I give a feeling that is the same. I'm a powerful, super inner strength. No belief or country could ever shame. I'm the spirit of America. Yes. And I'm proud to have that name.